What the hell is this place? Batman. I'm glad you came, Jim. You need to see this. What is this place? Who are these people? Before it killed him, Joker sent his infected blood out to all the hospitals in the state. I know. We tracked it all down. We missed some. How? Hospital errors. Transfusions that went unrecorded. Five people were affected. Untreated, the blood's gestated too long. It's altering them. They're becoming... Joker. My God. It's a form of Creutzfeldt-Jakob disease, but mutated beyond anything on medical record. What about that one? He doesn't look like the others. Henry Adams. He's been infected the longest, but he's symptomless. Immune to Joker's blood. I've got Robin running tests to find out why. One thing's for certain. Henry's the key to all this. I cooperated. I've done everything you asked. You said it would only take a few days. You can't hold him here against his will. We're close, Jim. We can't let him go until we save the others. Wait. You said five. I only count four. There's one missing. He'll be here soon. Can you hear me, Bruce? Oh, don't act all surprised, Bats. 
You knew this was going to happen sooner or later. Me stuck deep inside you. Together, we're going to give this city what it deserves. A new Batman. A better Batman. A darker one. <laughs> we can come back to this later. First, we need to agree on some priorities. Sure, you've saved the city by reducing the blast, but Ace Chemicals is still about to explode. You need to start looking out for yourself. After all, you're brooding for two now. <laughs> Alfred. Oh, thank God. When the explosion... I thought you might be... It's okay, Alfred. I managed to reduce the blast radius and prevented the toxin from spreading into the city. But what about Scarecrow? Or this Arkham Knight character? They've got tanks, missiles. Their forces are all over Gotham. Crane got away. I was exposed to his toxin. Good Lord, are you all right? Remember what happened at the asylum? It's okay. I had a bad reaction. But it's over now. I freely got to hand it to Scarecrow. I've never been a fan of his concoctions up till now, but this match, it's uh, <laughs> intoxicating. It really brings out the me in you. <laughs> Sir, did you hear what I said? Commissioner Gordon has been trying to contact you. Thanks, Alfred. Jim. You got out. See, I said you wouldn't let me down. I need to speak to you. Sure. What is it? Meet me outside GCPD prisoner detention. I'm heading there now. Alfred, analyze the militia forces, troop deployments, equipment, movements. I want to know exactly what I'm up against. I'll perform a full analysis of the occupying forces and report back shortly, sir. You might fool everyone else, but you can't fool me. There's something different about you. You're afraid. You've always buried your fears. Lock them away deep in your subconscious, hidden. But something is gnawing away in the darkness of your mind. Way to the surface. I can all 
the look on his face when you tell him his daughter's been kidnapped. <laughs> and it's all your fault. This is going to be cool. Gotta go. Batman's here. What's wrong, Jim? Come on, you're scaring me. It's Barbara. She's been taken. No, no, no. I spoke to her. She said she got out. She left hours ago. Stay calm. We'll get her back. Which one? Who's got my little girl? Scarecrow. They took her from the clock tower. All right, we need to go. There could be a clue, something that will lead us to her. I'll follow. Stay in contact. You've got to tell him it's your fault at some point, Bats. And the great thing is, I'll be standing right there when you do. Jim, I need you to stay focused. It's dangerous out there. Drive slow and let me deal with any trouble. Why did I let this happen? There's no way you could have predicted this, Jim. It's my job to predict it as a cop and a father. The whole thing's gone down on my watch. Up ahead, we got company. Who are they? A militia. I'll handle Pursuing forces, this is Arkham Knight. Your priority is to apprehend Commissioner Gordon. I say dead. Your priority is to apprehend the Commissioner. I want him alive. Let nothing stand in your way. Dangerous, Jim. Get in the Batmobile. I'll take us to the clock tower. Just get us there in one piece, Batman. We're running out of time. of the Arkham Knight's forces you requested. What have you got, Alfred? I've set the Bat Computer to analyze militia presence across the three islands and provide you with a real-time representation of the occupation strength in each zone. As you can see, Miyagani Island is heavily occupied, with a substantial drone ground force controlling the roads. Founders Island is the militia stronghold, protected by long-range radars and a missile launcher. I'd recommend keeping the Batmobile away from there for the time being. The remaining drone forces on Bleak Island have been redeployed to protect the clock tower, so expect significant resistance. Thanks, Alfred. I'm heading there now. Sergeant! Y yes, sir? The extraction squad's down. Take control of the clock tower drones. He's coming. Switching to manual control. I'll stop him, sir. Jim, the clock tower is surrounded. I'll clear the area and let you know when it's safe to head inside. You're losing control, Sergeant. <sighs> the movement on that thing, it's, it's difficult to get a lock.
There are militia troops all over the clock tower, Jim. You'll be safe in the Batmobile. I'll let you know when the area is secure. I'm not just sitting here while you go after those bastards. Yes, you are, Jim. Barbara wouldn't want you to get yourself killed. I'll be in touch the minute I'm done. The second. It's not safe to enter without taking out the militia troops on the roof of the clock tower. Jim, the area is secure. Meet me in the clock tower. I'm impressed. But your tricks don't seem new from all bad hands. Colleen? Is that you again? Candygram! Oh, don't pass out just yet. Come on. Show a little spy. Wait till you 
your father gets home, he's going to be furious about all this mess. Nothing like a trip down old memory lane, eh, Bats? And now a front row seat to the main event. You would have thought old Jim Gordon had been through enough. First, some handsome young maniac cripples his daughter. Now he's blaming himself for her being taken. You really should tell him this is your fault, Bats. I'm sure he'll understand. I mean, it's not like you went out and got his daughter killed. Well, not yet, anyway. The night's still young. Jim's on his way up. I can't do that now. This isn't your fault, Jim. Of course it is. Crane's done this to get to me. I should have been here. There's something I need to show you. We haven't got time. She's not like us. She's strong, Jim. Stronger than you realize. She works for you? This is all your fault. I will find her. She's my family! My daughter! She's all I've got! I never should have trusted you. Never! I'll do this on my own. Stay away from my family. I think that went quite well, considering. Of course, I wouldn't have told him, but that's why it's so liberating being me. You've got a lot to look forward to, Bats. I need to find out what happened to Barbara. They covered their tracks by disabling the clock tower security cameras. If I hack the municipal CCTV system, I should be able to monitor all access points to the building.
No, that won't work. I need to find out how Barbara was taken. That's the Arkham Knight. He's got Barbara. I need to confirm which car he took her in. That's the Arkham Knight. He's got Barbara. I need to confirm which car he took her in. That's no good. I need to find out who took Barbara and how they're transporting her. Concentrate. I need to find who took Barbara and how. There. That's the vehicle they took Barbara away in. Those tires are Amertech D60s. I can program the Batmobile to track their unique tread pattern. It'll lead me right to them. Lockdown clock tower. Authorization, Batman. Now that I think about it, how did Scarecrow know to go after your IT department? I mean, I had no idea she worked for you when I shot her. I just got lucky. Seriously, I was aiming for her head. Oh, if I'd only had a video camera when I swept Barbara off her feet. <laughs> Poor old Jimbo had to make do with a slideshow. 